Hello there guys, welcome along to the GeoWorks channel. My name's Mike and uh, it's Friday evening in the UK, 8 o'clock, it's time for a bit of PlayStation Gran Turismo Sport is what we're going to do this evening. And um, just before I uh, start off on that, I just want to give a bit of a shout out to uh, everybody uh, on Twitter and some of the new subscribers that have come along today. Um, we've been having a, a bit of a chat on Twitter, a lot of people retweeting and following and so on and so on. And it's been a brilliant community uh, atmosphere on Twitter for the last couple of hours where people have just been kind of supporting each other, supporting small streamers, all the hashtags that go along with that. So I just want to give a little bit of a shout out to uh, Universal YT, Son of the Boss, Streaming Consultant, Oops Gaming, Shuffle R Gaming, TM Gaming, LP Movies, Gang and Nath TL40, and Hey YouTube youtube tech thank you very much for following me on twitter today very much appreciated and welcome along if it is your first time uh, watching one of my broadcasts or being part of the geoworks channel and community so what i'm going to do today is as i say it's a grand turismo sport playstation 4 so we're going to buy the ferrari dino which was released in the 1.32 January 2019 update that came out yesterday uh, or was it the day before anyway 48 hours ago uh, January 2019 if you're watching this in the future so I'm gonna have a little look um, one of my other videos not so far back in the list will show the cars that the update includes and a couple of other things that are there uh, if you want to have a little look about a look at that um, so this is the Ferrari Dino 1971 car that's just been released <clears throat> and as I showed on the previous video uh, there's loads of colour choices so I mean it's got to be red doesn't it so there's a Rosso Chiaro Rosso Dino so if you look in the bottom left the name of the colour is in the bottom left so maybe Rosso Ferrari uh, Rosso Dino uh, the track identifier has just gone over it yep okay let's go with Rosso Dino I think and it should be 500,000 yep there we go and I've got 1.5 million credits use in-game credits yes okay yeah I certainly don't want to be paying any money uh, it's easier to quite quite easy to earn credits in the game and uh, yeah I want to use that now so there we go that's brand new car no idea what it's going to drive like uh, so I've just before I came on air I just had a quick look at what is potentially um, what will it qualify to be raced in and in campaign under amateur there is no sorry big pardon under professional there is La Festa Cavallino which is for all Ferrari models so as you can see I've done a couple of these before and what I think I'll do we'll go with Monza on this one ah it doesn't let me choose it why doesn't it let me choose it it's only the 458 Italia hmm okay Why is that then? Race details. Wow. Okay. Hmm. Information. All Ferrari models. Ah, but not the Dino. Okay, that's a bit odd. So let's go and find another challenge that it lets us go into. Uh, hmm. No. 
I'm just going to let us go in the club and cup because I think you can get anything. Yeah, no model restrictions. So let's do Maggiore is an Italian track. There we go, Dino. Just have a little go and see what it's like. That's very, very strange. Why the Ferrari car challenge doesn't let you use a Ferrari? Very bizarre. Yeah, so anyway, thank you very much for subscribing. Keep on subscribing if you haven't already. If you are watching this, uh, I will be giving somebody a free game when I get to 50 subscribers, just as a thank you for the support on the channel. Uh, I've had probably about another six subscribers today, I think, something like that which is fantastic. Thank you very much if you are watching this and you're a first time subscriber. And uh, yeah, definitely check out some of the other videos and games I play. So let's have a little go at this Dino and see what it's like. Let's have a look at the inside, classic car. Take it gingerly on the first corner. Just going to change the view so I can get used to the track a little bit. Whoa, holds itself well in the corner there. Done this track quite a few times on other challenges. Let's get a bit of slipstreaming in here. Go back to my favourite view. Well, so I'm just changing that centre. Centre info thing has changed. It normally has the track layout. It's got a radar. It's got session time, traction control. Oh, there's the track map. There we go. It's better. I prefer the track map in the centre underneath the speedo rather than having to keep look up into the top right. And it just distracts you from what you're trying to do and focusing on corners and things. But I have to say this handles really, really well. Ooh, cheeky. Yeah, the gentlemanly conduct sometimes in these games is a little bit... Uh, they tell you to do it when you have to train in uh, some of the challenges that you, they put you on, but all the AI cars just completely ignore that and just ram into you anyway. Alright, so we've got five laps of this track. It's going to be a bit of a hard slog, only 13 so far. try and tackle some of these corners a little bit more aggressively I think. Get too deep into that one. Please feel free to leave a comment if you want to, or is there anything that you want to see that you've watched before, a different game, you want to see me carry on playing, follow me on Twitter at GeoWorksUK. Got a few games I need to carry on with, which is Need for Speed and uh, Doom. I'm going to get back into Doom soon. Start killing a few of those Martian undead things that are in there. unlikely but if there's any of the game developers watching this they really could do with changing that Ferrari challenge for all Ferraris uh, where you buy a Ferrari and you can't enter it I think that's a bit of a mistake that's uh, been overlooked uh, if anybody knows how to get in touch with those guys in fact I think I follow the Gran Turismo Sport guy uh, I can't remember his name the Japanese guy I think I follow him on Twitter actually so I might just ping him a message 
and see if we can get that changed in the next update. Customer feedback and all that. So let's try driving with the in-car shot. Love the designs on some of these cars. But I just found it a little bit hard to see. Formula One guys, where they get a bit of a toe. Oh, yeah. Ah, he nudged me. Okay. Definitely needs a tweak. Don't think I'm going to get first place. as it were, straight out of the garage. It's quite nice to handle. It's just not got enough grunt to it. ST. Hmm. Oh, the power slide on that then. Hey, what's happening? The back end's stepping right out. Okay, one more lap. Let's get at least seventh or sixth or something like that got me done safe face. <laughs> I've won this before so late if I keep him behind me. But he 
he's quicker than me, I think. seconds off the leader. I'm never going to win, but... Ah, oh, no, I lost it on the last corner. Keep him behind me. And steal eighth place. Haha. <laughs> Yeah, 43 seconds behind is not good. We'll take the money. And I think we definitely need to do some tweaking on the car. So I'm going to sign off this one. The next video will be the car tweaked on a different course. Catch you in a minute.